हेलो फ्रेंड्स थर्ड ऑर्गेनिक प्रिपरेशन दैट इज अ प्रिपरेशन ऑफ बेंसाइक एसिड फ्रॉम द बेंजाम इट इज अ हाइड्रोलाइसिस रिएक्शन इन विच अ बेंजाम इज कन्वर्टेड इन टू द बेंसाइक एसिड फेयर द सीओ एन एच टू ग्रुप इट इज कन्वर्टेड इन टू द सीओ ओ एच ग्रुप सो इट इज द हाइड्रोलाइसिस रिएक्शन बट इट ऑकर्स इन प्रेजेंस ऑफ सोडियम हाइड्रोक्साइड the chemicals and the apparatus which are required for the organic preparation are a round bottom flask a water condenser funnel beaker a benzamide 10% nawh and concentrated hydrochloric acid these are the apparatus as well as chemicals now here you can see a water condenser is used so it indicates there is a heating condition in this preparation and a 10% nawh is used along with the concentrated hydrochloric acid so this hydrochloric acid is used to neutralize the excess amount of sodium hydroxide as well as to convert the salt into the product how let's see the reaction here the reaction is simple one benzamide is converted into the benzoic acid no doubt but actually this benzamide it is in the first step it is converted i will write for this benzene ring i will write here a ph this co as it is and instead of nh2 there is a formation of ona so in the first step here we get a formation of the salt and this salt when it is acidified with the hcl this salt is converted into the benzoic acid as well as the nawh which is present in a excess amount it is neutralized so that this reaction occurs via the formation of the salt and finally we get a benzoic acid as a product here there is a breaking of carbon nitrogen bond and there is a formation of carbon oxygen bond this is a simple hydrolysis reaction occurs in presence of the sodium hydroxide or we can say that in presence of the alkali now we will see the actual process or the procedure observed in a preparation of benzoic acid from the benzamide before actual procedure here you can see there is a evolution of nh3 keep in mind evolution of nh3 so before starting with the actual procedure see the pictorial representation of the procedure so here is the benzamide round bottom flask nawh water condenser hcl ice bath and so on now see the actual procedure 1 g of benzamide and uh, 15 ml of sodium hydroxide is taken into the round bottom flask initially so this round bottom flask contains 1 g benzamide 15 ml sodium hydroxide this round bottom flask is then heated and in the heating condition water condenser is attached to this round bottom flask and heated about uh, 30 minutes so just we have to heat this uh, round bottom flask for 30 minutes now in the chemical reaction we have seen there is a evolution of ammonia therefore when benzamide is heated with the nawh the ammonia is evolved and this ammonia is tested by a turmeric paper now this turmeric paper it is uh, dissolved in the water or in uh, other word we can say that a moist turmeric paper is taken and it is kept on the top of this water condenser when the ammonia is evolved from this water condenser the turmeric paper the color of this turmeric paper changes to the brown it indicates the ammonia is evolved from this water condenser now after sufficient heating that is about 30 minutes all the ammonia is evolved from this reaction mixture and after 30 minutes when reaction is completed when we put this turmeric paper on the top 
the color of this turmeric paper remains as it is it indicates there is a completion of the reaction and here there is a formation of rcoona that is a salt is formed in the reaction mixture so naoh when it is heated with the benzamide after 30 minutes we get a salt and this round bottom flask is uh, removed from this water condenser and it is kept in a ice bath it is the reaction mixture here there is a formation of the salt that is rcoona here r is nothing but the ph let's see here there is a 15 ml naoh all the amount of this naoh it is not utilized for the hydrolysis of benzamide some amount of naoh remains as it is in the reaction mixture therefore we have to add a concentrated sulfuric acid in the round bottom flask that will neutralize the remaining naoh as well as it will acidify the salt so salt it converted into the corresponding acid by acidification reaction so excess amount of scl is added slowly in this round bottom flask till the solution in the round bottom flask becomes acidic at this condition all the naoh all the salt they are neutralized and here there is a formation of a solid occurs at the acidic condition therefore whatever the solid which is formed or which is separated from this reaction mixture it is then filtered washed with the water and it is dry so that we get here a crude benzoic acid now this benzoic acid it is recrystallized from the hot water to get a pure product and this pure product it is used for a determination of the melting point the weight of this product suppose it is found to be a 0.8 g and the melting point of the recrystallized product suppose it is about a 122 degree celsius so this is the actual procedure occurring in the preparation of benzoic acid from the benzamide first of all we have to add a benzamide and naoh in the round bottom flask then it is heated for 30 minutes the evolution of ammonia is tested by turmeric paper if the color of this turmeric paper remains as it is it indicates the completion of the reaction after the completion of reaction the round bottom flask is removed from the water condenser and it is cooled in a ice bath in the round bottom flask there is a formation of the salt due to the reaction of naoh and benzamide this salt and the remaining sodium hydroxide it is neutralized by adding the excess amount of concentrated hydrochloric acid then this reaction mixture becomes a acidic one at this condition when it becomes acidic the solid is going to separate out from the reaction mixture it is then filtered then washed and dried to get a crude product this crude product it is recrystallized from the hot water and the melting point of this product is taken so two quantities here we are getting a 0.8 g as a crude product and the melting point is 122 degrees celsius now we will see the last part that is the result of this uh, preparation in the result the weight of the product is a uh, 0.8 g and in the kilogram it is 0.8 into 10 raised to minus 3 whereas the melting point of the product that is recrystallized product it is found to be 122 degrees celsius it is the observed melting point and it is converted into the kelvin that is 395 kelvin in this preparation we have to keep in mind though the reaction is simple one it occurs via the formation of a salt and which is then acidified to give a corresponding benzoic acid the 
main purpose of the addition of the concentrated hydrochloric acid is that it should neutralize the excess amount of sodium hydroxide as well as it should acidify the salt which is formed in the first step. So this is all about the preparation of benzoic acid from the benzamide. Now we will stop here and in the next video we will see the estimation of Easter.